And we've been national for the last 70-odd years, but we've just started to experiment with pushing funding back down to regions. We, th we think this will start to be the way to bring a new approach to the funding system. So last Friday, we launched the whole of Greater Manchester, uh, 3 million people, about £6 billion of public funding going into not just to health, but also into social care and education, and saying to them, why don't you just pull your budgets, work out new funding models, and let's try and move a lot of the funding upstream uh, to deal with some of the causes of poor health in the first place and, and, and have less focus on hospitals. They've managed to get together 10 local governments, uh, about eight different hospitals, a large number of commissioning organizations and, and, and GPs around the table to say, we've got a problem. This is a huge city. It's England's second big city. How are we going to sort it out? And so we say to them, we'll give you the money, but we'll hold you accountable for the outcomes. We're not going to, we're not going to prescribe the process, but we'll hold you accountable for outcomes. Now, this is our first experiment. But also, we are planning to roll this out more generally across the country over the next few years. Not running everything from London, but actually saying to local communities, join up the budgets, stop being siloed approach. Because if you have too much silo approach and you fund institutions rather than populations, you lose sight of what you can actually achieve in a joined up, integrated healthcare system. 